You know, when you look around, you realize that engineering design is everywhere, from the chair you're sitting in, to the monitor you're looking at, to the countless innovative technologies that we use every day. Learning how to be an engineer is about dreaming big and working collaboratively across disciplines. Welcome to FSC 100, Introduction to Engineering. This is a project-based course centered around the engineering design process, what it is, and how to use it. You'll collaborate with a small team of your peers to create a solution for a challenging real-world problem that you choose to solve. The engineering design process guides the way. It's an iterative path that starts with defining a problem, then using research, brainstorming, modeling, and testing, your team applies engineering knowledge and skills to craft an innovative solution. This video gives you a sneak peek into what awaits you in this course and offers tips on how to excel. First, let's talk about the timeline and workload. It's a fast-paced, two-credit course that runs for seven and a half weeks. You'll have two to three assignments due each week. Some you'll submit as an individual, others as a team. Expect to dedicate 12 to 13 hours per week to stay on track. It's a balance of self-directed work and online collaboration. You'll learn some valuable project management skills, which are necessary to plan and schedule the tasks for the project. Each member of your team will sketch design ideas and make a 3D model using CAD software. You'll also learn how to build an electronic circuit board with inputs like sensors and outputs like motors. And then you'll learn how to program the board using Arduino code, very similar to C++. Developing communication skills is also a big part of this course. Along with writing technical reports, your team will create a multimedia presentation to showcase its ideas and proposed solutions. In the past, teams have created squads of simulated robots that work together to solve a problem, like automating agricultural tasks for an inaccessible farm site. Your team may choose to focus on an issue that's closer to home, like pet grooming, or a challenge that's completely out of this world, like asteroid mining. Consider these tips for success as you prepare to begin this course. Engineers value collaboration. Build strong relationships with your teammates by fostering a supportive environment. Communicate early and often with your team. Be reliable and consistent with your contributions. Steady practice is essential for mastering engineering concepts and technology. Engage deeply with the course content and practice along with the tutorials to fully grasp the underlying principles. At any time throughout the course, ask for help. Questions about the content are a part of the process. Seek the answers through virtual office hours, online Q&A forums, or one-on-one -on -one consultations. Your peers, teachers, and TAs are your support system. This course is about diving headfirst into the world of engineering, challenging your capacity to innovate, make informed decisions, collaborate with your peers, and master essential CAD and coding skills. Whether you're just starting out or aiming to reach new heights, this adventure is tailor-made for you.